When the name of He's real. Batman, kill him! Somebody, tell Crane! What are you supposed to be? Got arson. I've alerted the fire department, sir. You should be able to find an exit to any of Not until I find Crane. About the gimp. What about him? We're gonna leave him locked up while this place burns. Watch it! Hell yeah. Crane's got the poor bastard gassed out of his mind. He'd tear our lungs out if we took him off that chain. I say let him burn. Put him out of his misery. Hey! Hey, I'm your friend. Scared of you. That was Carl. He says the Batman's here. Double hey, time hey. at you two. I want to be out of here now. Burning. This place is gonna blow. blow. Luckily, I've got my patience to do that for me. Nagari, Mostali, Califal, Maxura Nune Gune Paishatiye. Razal Ghul says that if you want to be Death's journeyman, you 
cannot feel it. Ready or not, death does not wait. Death is not considerate or fair. And make no mistake, in this chamber you are facing death. Do not return to this room until you are ready to join the League of Shadows. This way, Wayne. There is no space in the League for hesitation. You've already tempered your fists. I know you understand violence, but anger alone will not win your battles. The ninja is thought invisible. But invisibility is largely a matter of patience and distraction. Attack one of the three men before you. Show me you have the wisdom to be ruthless. Wayne, if you run, you will be discovered easily. Stealth is your greatest ally. Enemies with weapons are the most dangerous. Always attack them first, without mercy. Excellent, Wayne. Destroy the strongest of your opponents first, and others will fear you and fall in the mercy you deny them. We'll carry on. not have come to this place if you were seeking out the easiest path. This way is barred. Find another way through. There are more ways around a door than a key. Throwing weapons are a ninja's hand, not his fist. By them, a man alone may surround and confuse his enemies. Shuriken wait before you. Take them, and I will train you in their use. Shuriken wait on the far side of those flames. Surroundings, Wayne. Every gift is a potential trap. Look around trap. your environment for opportunities, Wayne. Your environment will only work to your advantage if you make it do so. Use the shuriken to create a path before you. Can't enter there until you have completed one last challenge. Follow me. In the room.
room beyond, you'll find your next to final test, one of intimidation. The three ninja in the next chamber have been instructed on pain of death to keep the passphrase from you. Don't make your presence known until you've become a wraith in their minds. I've left you a gift in the room beyond. Use it to convince them you are more terrible than death, and they will give you the words. Use the wires above to cross without alerting the men below. Did Ducard tell you what to expect? Quiet. I don't trust Wayne. He's not one of us. There is a violence to him. All the more reason for silence. It was your environment, Wayne. Break the support cable with the shuriken. Show them fear. Wayne did that. He's out of his mind. He's one man and still in training. We can handle him. <coughs> now, Wayne, we are ready. A week. Finish them off. You know what I want. Please, don't. The card would kill me. And I'll make you wish I would. What's the passphrase? Please. It's... Looking Glass. Don't tell the card I told you. Looking glass. Welcome. Welcome, Wayne. We have come to your final lesson. Lower the prisoner in his cage. Excellent. Now, come here. We have purged your fear. You are ready to lead, ready to become one of the League of Shadows. But first, you must demonstrate your commitment to justice. He is a murderer and a thief. He cannot be allowed to live. No. I'm no executioner. You must have the will to act, or you are not fit to lead these men into Gotham. Gotham? As its favorite son, you are ideally placed to strike at the heart of criminality. That city has become a festering wound of suffering and injustice. It cannot be saved, and must be allowed to die. You can't believe in this. Wayne, what are you doing? What needs to be done? Way. You will die. Escape! 
path is clear. Save yourself. I can separate him from his thugs, but he's arranged for a police presence as well. No doubt crap, sir. I still can't attack them directly. I'll need a way around. I'll search Gotham Records for an alternative route. Optic cable, it could give you advantage on what threats these doors hide. What's he doing here? Please, you don't know Falcone. He's horrible. I'm here. He isn't. And I'm worse. What's he doing? <laughs> Smuggling. Shipments come in from Southeast Asia weekly. Falcone cuts them up, hands them out to his dealers, but... Keep talking. Something's different this time. Something's happening in the sewers. And Falcone wouldn't start pulling favors with the cops unless he was... from police radio on boats? Yes, sir. Gotham police have at least one squad of marksmen on the water. I wouldn't suggest putting yourself within their range. Then I'm gonna need access to the sewers. I'll mark the nearest entrance point on your radar, sir. The guys are already back there. Yeah, I'm coming. We'll put some hustle in it. Falcone wants us on standby in that van. And he don't like to ask twice. If I may, Master Bruce, the number of men waiting in that van may be too great a force for even you to take on single-handed. Only if it's a fair fight. That forklift might shift the odds a little more in my favor. It's got Falcone on edge. What, what, what in the name of... Falcone brought a small army for a simple cargo drop. What's he afraid of? 
I don't know. I, I think something's happening in the sewers. How do I find Falcone's shipment? Bears! I'm gonna need more than that. He puts the powder in pl plastic bags inside of stuffed bears. It's how he's done it for years. It won't work in all cases, but you are skilled enough that your pick should make short work of most locks. Test the tensile strength on the grapple. Could it be dangerous? The advantages are worth the risk. It gives me a higher vantage point from the drop on my enemies. Very sensible, sir. What's going on? Just put down the gun, all right? I can't do that, Mac. Just let me through and you never see me again. Couldn't even if I wanted to. Uh, uh... <laughs> what in the name of... <laughs> you can come out. Whoa, what are you? I'm here to help. I need to get deeper into the sewers. What's going on down here? These tunnels are filled with our men, and now you... Whatever you are... I don't have time to explain. None of us do. Nobody's supposed to be here. The only reason I am is to survey for tomorrow's repair crew. The release valve on the dock's steam pipes rusted shut. If anybody opened up all the feed pipes, the whole system could burst. Would anybody be hurt? Probably not, but it would be pretty dramatic. And real expensive. How do I get to the feed pipes? There's a door behind you. The keypad code is my anniversary. 1227. You're not gonna do anything crazy, are you? Do I look like I'd do something crazy? Where you are is as safe as you're gonna get. Keep your head down and wait for dawn. Ah, oh, man. I should have called in sick today. I have a feeling that Wayne Enterprises will be writing a check tomorrow to the Gotham Water Authority for steam damage. Just leave me a blank place to sign. And the feed pipe valves? There are three of them. I've located them on your radar, sir.
then I wish you'd hurry up and get the rest of it down here. Whatever's going on with these pipes is freaking me out. You and me both. It's no news to anybody that the docks off his rocker, but insisting on taking the shipment through the sewers is a new level of paranoia. I've heard rumors that the doctor's half of Falcone's shipment ain't recreational. Yeah, there's all sorts of talk going around. All I know is, the sooner we're through with the job and out of here, the better. Andy said you saw what was inside one of the rabbits. Yeah. So? So what? So don't be so mysterious. What is it? You got me. Not the stuff Falcone pushes. What did it look like? White, like powdered sugar. The guy who split it open was wearing a face mask and rubber gloves up to his elbows. Sounds serious. salary. <laughs> yeah, I bought the boat. Me and the wife are taking it over to Coast City next weekend. Nice. How about you? What are you doing with your bonus? Eh, I got an ex-wife and three kids in college. You want to talk about robbery? Yeah, thank God in Gotham for Falcone's piggy bank. What would the law do without him?
So what's with the rabbits? Because Falcone can't just ship in clear plastic baggies. He's got the cops in his pocket, not the whole damn city. But I thought bears were his thing. They are. The rabbits are something new. The bears are standard powder. They go straight to the dealers. And the rabbits? They go somewhere in the narrows. What does that mean? That's all I know. I tried to push further. Falcone <clears throat> told me not to stick my nose anywhere. It might get cut off. Alfred, I need encryption prefixes. Right away, Master Bruce. You should be able to get into the machinery systems now. messed up. Away from me. Tell me about the rabbits. I don't know any. It's funny. I believe you. Who does know? Falcone's playing his cards close to his chest. Whoever he's working for has got him spooked. Somebody knows. No. His advocate, his, you know, what do you call it? Consigliere. He'd know. Falcone tells him everything. How do I find him? He's the only guy in the docks in a $500 suit who's not Falcone. What scares him? I don't know. Falcone. Small spaces. He could tell you everything. What are you doing over here? Sorry, what do you mean? Ain't you supposed to be Falcone's right-hand man? I had to get some air. They went down to the ship's hold, and I'm not, uh, comfortable with small spaces. Uh-huh. You know anything about Falcone's guy in the Narrows? I heard. It would be best if you didn't ask. Sure. 
whatever. Do your worst! You'll get nothing from me! No! No! Please! Let me out! The walls! Please! I, I, I can't stand you come this! come out when you talk! Please! Anything! Just let me out! I want to know about bears and rabbits. It's how Falcone smuggles his shipments in. The bears go to dealers, the rabbits are something new. What are they? I don't know what's in them. It's serious. They go to some guy in the Narrows. What guy? I don't know his name. Falcone's more secretive than he's been about anything before. He's some kind of doctor. I think he works at Arkham. How do I find Falcone's shipment? It's mostly been divided up already. <laughs> Please let me out. Falcone's shipment. How do I find it? White Falcons! They're spray-painted on his crates! I... I can't! I can't! That sounds like evidence. Falcone's crates? Exactly. I believe a large number are in the hold of the container ship docked nearby. Hey, buddy. You talking to me? Nobody else here, I must be talking to you. That's funny. You got a light? Nah, no time neither. You want the doctor's guys, right? What do you want to know for? Just curious. I'm afraid smoke grenades and other fear devices are only theatrics, Master Bruce. They'll only work on enemies already in a state of fear.
How did that happen? Who did that? If Falcone sees that, we're good as dead. So get to work. He's just at the end of the pier. Whatever you are, you're dead. Get the hell away from me. <laughs> <laughs> Mesa Falcone is being protected by a small army and a large arsenal. A forward attack may be too great a risk. This isn't a matter of force. Falcone's been beaten before. He knows he can always get back up. I want to get close. Show him my nightmare. Show him there's something on these streets more frightening than him. And how exactly do you intend to get close to him? Outside of using force? I'll bring him to me. That crane. Very creative, sir. One could almost believe that you enjoy this.
Carbon 2. They said it was some kind of creature, something like a man, but it couldn't be stopped. Anything that walks can die. I'm happy to prove it to any man here. Where's my damn boat? I called, but... Well, call again. Get down to the pier. Row the damn thing in if you have to. Yes, sir. I don't want to see your face again on dry land. You understand me? Perfectly, sir. What are the rest of you standing around for? Get your guns out of your holsters and your heads out of your eyes. Anything moves, you kill it. If you've got questions, we'll ask the corpses. Hello. Dear Lord, don't kill me. I need to get through that door. I, I have a key. Please, just don't hurt me. I don't know, man. I don't see it. It's out there. You can count on help. What about all those cops? Forget about them. Everybody knows the Gotham PD is as dirty as a brothel's outhouse. What if it's the Coast Guard? They can't be too copacetic with Falcone's in the It ain't the Coast Guard, it's the cops. And they're deeper in Mr. Falcone's pocket. Intercepted a signal from Falcone's boat, Master Bruce. I'm afraid you only have a few moments before it docks. Yeah, still nothing, man. Thought I saw a shadow for it.
Leave that superstitious crap for the Bush Leagues. I want to know who he's working for and how I can hurt him. I'm not going to keep playing errand boy while that white-collar geek crane barely lifts a finger. What in the name of... What the hell is going on? Somebody help me! What in the name of... Get me down from here! What are you staring at, you slack-jawed morons? Lower this damn thing! Ah! What? What the hell are you? I'm Batman. Sir, I have the recording of Lucius Fox's message from Wayne Enterprises. Thanks to Earl's love for bureaucracy, we've got no idea what they stole. But whatever it was, it's big. They pulled it off in a big rig with a small army of cars running in appearance. So I'll need to take down that freight truck. Yes, sir. But you'll have to get through its fleet of escort vehicles first. And I'm afraid they've hijacked the narrow barrel bridge. You won't be able to get to it before they've raised it. That doesn't mean I can't cross it. Get him down! 
Tony will be in the pen long? Nah, the guy's got a bank account full of get out of jail cards. Yeah, but we got a few days peace and quiet anyway. Ah! Oh! The Batman! Whatever you are, you're dead. Make me hurt you.
you found a way to slip quietly into Falcone's club, sir. Like a church mouse. Did you find the GPD files? Of course, sir. And despite the enforced sabbatical you so kindly gave Falcone, the club remains quite active. You'll certainly find Detective Flass inside. How do I get in? You'll need a passphrase at the entrance. It changes daily, but the character of such a secret's keeper would suggest that any number of the local gentlemen would likely share it. If properly persuaded. Come on, just let me up. Not without the magic word. It's Jeff, you know me. How do I get upstairs? You're... you're real! I don't know! I don't know anything! If I let you live, what are you gonna do? Whatever you want me to do! Tell your friends what's come to Gotham. I'll tell them! I'll tell everybody! So what? Does it, like, uh, cook things? How the hell should I know? All I did was drive the truck. But it's a microwave weapon, right? What the hell was that? Who did that? Holy crap! How did that happen? Keep your panties up. The Batman! If I may be so bold, sir, if you don't leave any of these men conscious, no one will be left to interrogate for the past phrase. I want inside the market. Then go. What's the magic word? Um, please, go. The passphrase for the door. Sorry, don't hurt me. The phrase is little pig. Little pig, let me in. You got it.
found something that may be useful, Master Bruce. Detective Gordon has an informant inside the market. Is he still inside? Undoubtedly so. And according to his information, Falcone has the building covered with security cameras and booby trips. Where can I get a look at those camera views? It's a central security center, sir. Then that's how I find Flash in the traps boat. It looks like I just found the first of Falcone's traps. It appears so, sir. And unfortunately, Gordon's files indicate that they are triggered by infrared beams. They won't be visible until you trip them. Some kind of demon. I don't know, man. I heard some of Falcone's enforcers talking about it. None of those guys have a sense of humor. Falcone's old news. Gotham PD nailed him. Nah, it was the bat creature. They say he becomes a demon when you're most afraid. Machine gun is no joke. What are you so nervous about? That's the second alarm in ten minutes. Could be bad. Got a view of Flass. He's in a separate building. Ah, uh, that could be problematic. How so? Gordon's files show that the only access to the neighboring building is via Falcone's office. Apparently, it's reserved strictly for less savory activities. Looks like Falcone's office is occupied. The gentleman in Falcone's office is likely Gordon's informant, a certain Walter Feister. If so, he'll undoubtedly know how to gain access to the elevator. Then I'll have a talk with him. I've put a data tap on the system. The security cameras could come in handy. Of course, sir, but a word of warning. It appears that Feister is not alone. Maybe I'll give him a little privacy. If I may, sir. I've relayed the nearest security video to your onboard system. Do the cameras have an infrared wavelength? Yes. The Vantage should allow you to see and avoid the trigger beams.
Nobody's here. I'm gonna make a sweep. And Paulie never came back. You think it's trouble? I guess I'm gonna find out, aren't I? You really exist. Who's that? I need to get next door. I'm looking for a crooked detective named Flass. Who? You, you work for Falcone? No, I'm a hell of a lot worse. How do I get next door? Don't, don't hurt me. There's a construction truck. I don't think it works anymore. But that door will get you to it. The security code is 1337.
Falcone was bad enough, but now that he's gone, things are just getting worse. You ain't been handling that blue powder, have you? Messes with your head. Nah, nah. I'm not getting anywhere near that doctor or his damn chemicals. I'm getting out. I'm through. Abandoning ship? <laughs> go on that. Falcone likes keeping that door locked. Anything to keep a messy business at least a little discreet. You can get through with the digits 1024. Burn this once you've memorized the code. We don't want it getting around. Emma. Anything I'm sitting on top of? Precisely, sir. I think Flass knows he's in over his head. Flass has been dirty since forever. He knows how the game is played. Things been shook up, though. Falcone's down, this mysterious doctor suddenly stirring the pot, and we got whatever that bat thing is on top of everything else. Gotham's always been a sewer. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Getting a lot stranger, though.
trouble. We're in serious trouble. What do we do? I'd be asking if I did that. I thought we were supposed to be the only ones up here. I don't like this, man. The van stopped. There's definitely somebody in there. Why don't you go check? Me? But you're the one with a gun. Exactly. And I'm telling you to go have a look. Get that, man. What if it's that bat thing? I'd rather get shot. I'm calling for help. If there's enough of us, we can take anything. Chained to the damn wall. I'm not scared of you, Zaz. <laughs> You're. Who is Crane working for? I'll leave you your time. So you can bear. Who's Crane working for? Come a little closer. I'm warning you, Zaz. Just a little closer. I want to smell you. Mother. You've bought yourself a slow. Slow death, detective. You and me are taking the scenic route to hell. <laughs> sure thing, freak show. Line forms on the left. Hell's gonna be a relief for you, piggy. Whoa! in hell! Jeez. What? What? Uh! Somebody's trying to kill us? Calm the hell down! Bet freaking chance of that! I don't care what you are! <clears throat> Look out, Flaz! He's getting closer! <clears throat> <clears throat>
Don't be scared, Flass. Come over here. Oh, detective. This is gonna be some sweet hell. Why would I? That's what Zaz is here for. Let's get me alive. Yes, slowly. And I don't want to have to watch him do it. So I hope you're feeling talkative. What do you want to know? Falcone split his shipment in two. Only half of it was drugs. What was the rest? Some kind of chemical. Something hidden. It goes to the Narrows. To who? An, an Arkham doctor. His name's Crane. Jonathan Crane. What's the chemical? I don't know. I swear to God. Swear to me. Where is Crane? The Narrows. I don't know where the doctor is, but the toxin's being relayed from the abandoned science museum. If you find the chemical shipment, you can find Crane. Alfred, I'm outside the museum. There are reports of a helicopter on the roof of the archive warehouse, directly behind the museum. Besides, how the hell would we get it down? We could figure out a way. What's going on in here? We're supposed to be next door. Are you kidding me? This place is a gold mine. Look at all this stuff. It's gotta be worth millions. Don't be an ass. Where are you gonna find a fence willing to move a dinosaur skeleton? Um, he's got a point, Lawrence. Hey, man. I'll live. What the hell's going on? The Batman! This can't be happening! I can't see! What are you?
We're lucky that didn't kill us. That wasn't luck. What? We're being toyed with. What do you mean? The bat, he's toying with us. If he wanted us dead, we wouldn't have even seen it coming. Then what does he want with us? This can't be happening. <laughs> Don't make me hurt you. <laughs> Used to be all right. Yeah, all right. Dumb as a post, but all right. What happened? You didn't hear? Tom dosed himself. With what? That's the thing. Nobody knows. With whatever Dr. Crane's been getting smuggled in. He's like that from some drug? Yeah. But he's been like that for a week now. Yeah. I don't think he's getting better. Who I am. The bad man, please don't eat my soul. That's a new one. Where's Dr. Crane? I, I don't know. He's keeping everything under wraps. Whoever he's working for has got him spooked. Who does know where to find Crane? The pilot. There's an Arkham pilot on the roof. He's moving the toxin from Crane to us. He can lead you to him. Sounds like I need to have a conversation with that helicopter pilot. If I may, sir, so long as he has a clear escape route, what reason does he have to talk? Right. I'll handicap the helicopter first. Make sure he stays put until I tell him otherwise. Crap. 
Something bad's coming. That wasn't an accident. There's something out there. Some kind of... Anything about this uh, bat creature? He can't be real. They, they, they talk about him like he's some kind of demon. I don't know, man. I heard some of Falcone's enforcers talking about it. None of those guys have a sense of humor. Falcone's old news. Gotham PD nailed him. Nah, it was the bat creature. They say he becomes a demon when you're most afraid. That's just the chemical garbage we've been handling for the doctor. It's messing with our minds. I don't know, man. How many people have to have the same nightmare before it's real? Something's up. Oh, man. Careful with that stuff, man. You don't want to get it on your hands. Crane said it's not dangerous until he's processed it. You want to believe that? 
Tell it to those Frankenstein gimps in the red jumpsuits. Bald-headed things? Yeah, them. Have to keep their heads shaved so they don't scalp themselves. You should have given us gloves. Somebody should check that out. Something's out there. You all right? That nearly killed me. What the hell could have done that? This ain't worth it. Don't take me! I don't like waiting. What if the cops show? How long does it take you to get that bird airborne? Ten seconds, tops. So what are you worried about? Any trouble shows, you're long gone. Doesn't mean I like to wait. And nobody's paying you to like it. We'll wait for my guy to show. Crane won't like it if the shipment comes in a bundle short. Tell 
me where your boss is. What the? I don't know what you're talking about. I don't work for anybody. Lies! You work for Dr. Jonathan Crane. And you're gonna tell me where he is. I can't. Crane's got my brother in his hospital. Whatever you do to me, he'll do worse to Walter. If I let you go, leave Gotham. Don't come back. Never talk to Dr. Crane again. If he knows I'm coming, I'll know it was you. Okay! Whatever you say, I swear, you'll never see me again! Thank you. You won't regret this! That was unexpected. He's gonna try to use me as leverage to get his brother released from Arkham. I'll hitch a ride once the helicopter's airborne. He'll lead me right to Dr. Crane. There's a lack of mercy I expect from you, sir. Alfred, I need a way to get inside the asylum. Might I suggest donning a pair of tights and pretending you're a bat, sir? Cute. How do I get to Rachel? you? Miss Dawes is undoubtedly being held somewhere in the basement. Although I'd advise against a frontal assault, sir. The main gates appear to be well nigh crawling with Crane's criminals. A guy could start to think Dr. Crane's got a thing for us. What, is this place next? Kidding me? What? You got a car alarm? I can't stand that crap. So don't touch my car. I haven't had six straight hours of sleep in a month because of those things. Got my nerves all jangly. I happen to like my car. Somebody wants to mess with it. Up. That car alarm's not gonna do a damn bit of good here. Think about it. There's nobody for a mob of lunatics and criminals. Just don't mess with my car, is all. Now there's something there ought to be a law about: robbing somebody, assault. At least that shows initiative. 
We're putting a sign on the cars, just a, mm, what do you call it? Public nuisance. See what I'm talking about? We didn't do that. Somebody's here. First new message. Emma, hey, it's Jonathan here. Uh, listen, call me. I couldn't really make sense of your message, but if, if you think you're in danger, then get out of there. Seriously, call me. Second new message. This is a message for Dr. Thomas from Arkham HR. Your concerns about another doctor's experiments really are in our jurisdiction. We've passed them along to internal reviews. But we're happy to update your security code. Your new digits are 4563. Make sure you've erased this message once you've noted the code. Two new messages. First new message. Emma, hey, it's Jonathan here. Uh, listen, call me. I couldn't really make sense of your message, but if you think you're in danger, then get out of there. Seriously, call me. <laughs> Alfred, I've got a security gate in my way. Yes, sir. Asylum plans show a more than adequate lockdown system in place. Can they be opened remotely? I'm afraid not, sir. You'll have to find some other way around. Shut gate 17! Shut it! Now! One of Crane's gas-crazed freaks got loose! If only I had a cattle prod. I'd be a hell of a lot happier if Crane didn't insist on using those drug-crazed gimps as his guard dogs. Yeah, they're like animals. Nah, you can scare an animal. Troll. These things, though. I don't know what they are. What do you think he sees, anyway? What, that poor bastard? Yeah. I don't want to know. Hey, do you know what Crane ended up doing with the rabbits? Throw them out, I imagine. Damn. I was thinking I could give one to my daughter. You're not worried about the... Watch yourself. That thing shocked me a few hours back. No kidding. You're lucky it didn't fry you crispy. Sure as hell has enough juice to. Right. I'm luck all over. Sure. 
little shock therapy probably did you good. Hurry up and get it fixed. I don't like being out in the open like this. Don't rush me. I don't want to be here when that thing shows up. That whatever. Demon. He ain't a demon. This skylight is top priority. What does he care about upkeep? Why are you so jumpy? You don't really believe in the Batman, do you? Nah. All I know is Crane's scared. And whatever scares him sure as hell scares me. What do you mean? <coughs> Whoa. Where did Campbell go? What? Campbell's gone. Jason! Jason, you there? Crap. <laughs> You don't want to end up like the other doctors, do you? No! No, please! Dr. Crane is a very private man. He doesn't like his, uh, research meddled with. I don't know anything, I swear! So what were you doing in the basement? I was... I was just lost. Sure you were. You weren't nosing around any canisters or nothing. No! No, I don't know anything about the toxin. It, it's just... I didn't say anything about a toxin. Please, I just want to go home. Your home's a cell now, Dr. Thomas. A red jumpsuit in a world of hell. No! You don't have to worry too much. You'll have a lot of company by dawn. All right, enough of this. Let's throw her in brain surgery and ask Crane what he wants. No, stay back! You shouldn't be here, Dr. Thomas. And you especially shouldn't have been poking around down below. I didn't see anything! Please, just let me go! It's out of our hands, sweetheart. There are natural laws about what happens to curious kittens, isn't there? Alfred, find out what you can on a Dr. Emma Thomas. She has information on Crane. Right away, sir. And I'll need you to locate the brain surgery theater on my radar. That's where they're keeping her. Done, sir.
There's gotta be something edible in this Just place. Just grab something and let's go. We got work to do. Give me a second. I just want to find something that doesn't look like my grandmother already ate it. Does anybody smell gas? I nearly had a heart attack. I can keep the hand over here. Somebody! You in there, Dr. Thomas. Maybe you're feeling more talkative now? Believe me, you'd rather talk to me than Crane. Still feeling curious, feel free to sample one of those gas canisters. Give us a rest. What was that? Somebody there? Stay put, Doc. I'll be right. The Batman! <laughs> Alfred, what's my current position in relation to Arkham's power grid? Almost directly atop it, sir. Might I ask what you're planning? I'm gonna crack open that water tower. Use it to short out the power. Excellent idea, sir. Locate room 45 on my radar. The men at the front gates were talking about storing explosives. Right away, Master Bruce. Let no man underestimate your appetite for destruction. up where'd I put the keys you had them last well they're gone now that's just great Clarence shut up a second let me think
The asylum still has electricity. Those will be the backup generators, sir, which unfortunately have just enough power to keep the security gates sealed. Just enough? Precisely, sir. The asylum's electricity is cobbled together from a dozen jury rigged systems. You'll never kill the power entirely, but if you activate enough systems at once, you could overload it and create considerable chaos. Strange is going on. He's here. Who? Oh, the Batman. What do we do? What anyone does when a prowler comes around. Call the police. Alfred, I need you to locate Arkham circuit breaker boxes. The asylum's electrical system is already in chaos, Master President. It can always get worse. Ever the optimist. You'll find them on your radar, sir. Alfred, I saw Rachel. She's alive. Can you get to her, sir? Not from here. I'll find another way. What use are you to me? You're real? Don't... don't... I'll do anything. Is that all you're good for? Ah! The elevator head is locked. The key code to make it work is 5839. You can use that, right? 5839. Paulie, what's the holdup? Must be the lift's emergency brakes. I fixed the elevator. Uh, I mean, it should be working, but the release lever got stuck by the power surge. So I'm sticking. I'm not strong enough. Let me think. <laughs> hey, what's going on down there? Holy! Oh, you get this thing fixed? Ow, my way! That's not Polly.
This is driving me crazy. I gotta try to get this sorted out. Sort what? The electricity. The flickering lights. Feels like we're in a cheap slasher movie. Can you cover things while I'm gone? I can't look in two directions at once. Crane said we had to... You can handle it. I'll be back in a few minutes. You need to calm down. Start taking your vitamins or something. You look terrible. I know. I, I feel terrible. Listen, maybe I could hold on to the gun for a little while. Get out of here. Come on. It'd make me feel better. I'm not giving you the gun. But it would, really. No, get your own gun. Go, what the hell? The Batman. Come on, let's find out if he bleeds. Are you sure you really want to? Holy!
I'm looking for Dr. Jonathan Crane. <laughs> You're gonna help me. Take it! <laughs> Take it! <laughs> oh. Oh. Cops? Exactly. They can't stop us, but the Batman has a talent for disruption. Hold him off until they arrive. They'll take care of him. What about the girl? I very much doubt Batman's arrival on her heels was coincidence. Grab her, follow me. Well, what about us? What about that bat creature? I heard he can fly. I heard he can disappear. We'll wait here for him. Find out if he can die. Let's go. see him. Maybe it was something else. Let's hope so. You check over there, and I'll watch here. Shouldn't we move? I don't know, man. I think I can feel something. You're a man to things. Crane says it doesn't work until it's a gas. You're telling me you don't feel just a little funny? Listen, we've been doing this for three days now. Gotham's water supply is thick with this garbage. If it made you crazy, every man, woman, and child in the city would be howling at the moon. Alfred, 
They're spurting toxins into the city through the water pipes. I need a map. To trace the contamination, sir? No. It's too late to stop it. But I can use the sewers to get deeper into the asylum. he can be killed. What if he isn't human? He is nothing but a man exploiting your superstitions and your fears. You have him outnumbered and you know he's coming. Quickly. I don't like this man. You should be here by now. I got on the phone to Batman's secretary. Tell her he's late. That isn't funny. This isn't a funny situation. You scared too easy, Terry. Like the doc said, we got him outnumbered. 
and what was that what if it's him what if it's the batman you got a gun right yeah but i heard bullets pass right through him i heard he can't be killed oh <laughs> I don't know. I don't want to know. I shouldn't be here. Get a hold of yourself. I got kids. I can't... The Batman. Ha! Uh. Ah! I'm blind! I'm blind! You think that costume scares me? Oh. It's not necessary. My patience will see the end. a little bit further. The asylum is my spider web. Keep drawing him in. Let him get tangled. bit overkill for mental hospital, I know. But you'd be amazed at the garbage we deal with.
Gotham's finest, timely as always. Now, listen carefully. You and I are the sole survivors of Batman's lunatic rampage on the hospital. I saved your life, yes? The Batman tried to kill us all, and I saved you. The Batman. Who is he? What do you know about the Batman? Did he send you here? Who else knows? Talk, damn you. of your own medicine, Doctor. What have you been doing here? Who are you working for? Raz. Raz Al Ghul. Raz Al Ghul is dead, Crane. Who are you working for? Crane! Doctor Crane is in the air right now. But if you'd like to make an appointment, The Gotham police have the asylum surrounded, sir. The radio transmissions I've intercepted do not indicate a gentle approach to your capture. Is Jim Gordon with them? Yes, sir. He's leading a force of men into the lobby as we speak. All personnel authorized for deadly force. Repeat, all personnel. I need your help. She's been poisoned with a panic-inducing toxin. I'll take her to the medics. The medics can't help her, but I can. Get her downstairs. Meet me in the alley on the narrow side. What the hell is going on? Dr. Jonathan Crane. You'll find him in damp trousers in that office. He was the third man at the docks. Crane was smuggling his toxin hidden in Falcone's drugs, refining and testing them here, then dumping them into the water supply. What's he planning? Who's he working for? I don't know. Someone dangerous. Get her downstairs. She doesn't have much time. If he's in the building, we'll get him.
hit it all together. Ready? That man spotted. Need backup. That man spotted. Need backup. Stand by until we get reinforcements. Negative visual. Yeah, copy that. Switching to channel 9. I don't even know, man. This place is an absolute nightmare. Whatever. I'm covering my own six. I plan on walking out of here at the end of the night. Unit four is go, go, go! Stay with me. I need you to be tough for me. I'll take her. Take my car. I brought mine. Master Bruce. Keep it short, Alfred. Rachel doesn't have much time. Gold is helping this account, but you'll need to reach Gotham Battery Tunnel with all the drop fire right. What about helicopters? Incoming, sir. If one of the onboard SWAT snipers hit you with a tracking device, escape will be impossible. The car 30 is out of commission. Zero injuries. All available units in pursuit. Dispatch, where's my riot van? Tell Gordon we got the riot van incoming. I want that riot van to ignore dispatch. Take the Gotham battery tunnel. Suspect fleeing in black. Tank! 7912 in pursuit! Suspect spotted 7930 in pursuit. Got them. 
battery entrance, at least six cars involved. 703, SWAT helicopter incoming. All available EMT into Southern Gotham Battery. Airborne SWAT is using rifle fire. RAF transponders, sir. No fatalities on site. Injuries are very minimal. Stay out of the spotlight. steady. the antidote. Rachel's state is critical. It's waiting, Master Bruce. All that remains is to get here in time. Why? Why, please? No! Why? Why, please? No! Stop! Please! Why? Why, please?
Crane was working for you. His toxin is derived from our blue poppies. He weaponized it. But Crane knows nothing of the League of Shadows. He thinks we'll hold the city to ransom. Gotham will tear itself apart through fear. <laughs> I told you better than that, Crane. He'll destroy thousands of lives. Millions of lives. Gotham cannot be allowed to survive. It is the breeding ground for crime and suffering. Gotham is the heart of modern decadence and filth. We must rip that heart from our chest. Why are you holding back? You could have killed these men easily. Gotham can be saved. Not this time. And all those dead innocents? Innocents? No. Sacrifices. Like your parents. Like you. Still not learn to mind your surroundings as well as your opponent. This isn't over, Dakar. My name is Raz Al Ghul, and for you, this is very much over. Goodbye, Wayne. Save him. Then I'm coming to you. I'm by the grand piano, sir. <coughs> Hurry. <coughs> know that until we see the body. Then let's find that corpse. I don't want to burn to death in this decadent sewer. You still in one piece?
Fox. Lucius, what are you still doing here? I was nearly killed by some maniac in black pajamas. You have to get out of here. We need to manufacture your neurotoxin antidote on a large scale. That would take weeks. We don't have weeks. The toxin's already been dispersed. It's in our water supply. That doesn't make any sense. The toxin's an inhalant. Putting it in the water wouldn't work. Unless... What? Unless you had a microwave emitter powerful enough to vaporize the whole system. The kind recently stolen from Wayne Enterprise. Stay there! I'll find a way out for you! Damn it! Open! <clears throat> on fire. your own height. Are you still alive? No, sir, but loyal as always, waiting for the piano. I'll be there. I hope you didn't rush your mic out, sir. about the entire island. Ra's al Ghul's already vaporized the toxin. Of course, sir. But the crisis at hand is keeping it from spreading into Gotham proper. Someone is lowering the Narrowborough Bridge. Mobs poisoned by Crane's toxin could spill into the city. I'll stop the bridge. I'll put the control tower on your radar. And the uh, Batmobile? It stays on the tracks. The monorail can't reach Gotham without crossing that point. If I can't stop the train, the Batmobile's auto-destruct is my fail-safe.
Batman. Come to join my tea party. Crane. Oh no. Scarecrow. A few more minutes and the bridge will be down and Gotham will have so many more psychopaths than just you and I. I'm through playing games, Crane. Life is a game. So yes, maybe you are. survive the impossible. Who would know better, sir? I'm going after Ra's al Ghul and the microwave emitter. I need any information you can find. Of course, sir. It won't move. We don't have time. There are two more barriers after this keeping the monorail from Gotham. Then we'll use the explosives. All set. Blow the barrier.
give up, our ghoul would take. He's getting closer. We blow the barrier now. It's him! Blow the barrier!
Hello? I'm warning you. I just want to be your friend. Zaz! Get away from her. Batman. They say you're not mortal. They say you can't die. How much you want to bet I can make you wish you could. Nice work. Chalk therapy. You've seen the device that's causing all of this? Something they loaded onto the monorail? Yeah. I found the control station. They only have one train running. I think the tracks are blockaded to keep them out of Gotham. Not anymore. I need to get on that train. The monorail controls didn't look that complicated. I could probably stop the train long enough for you to get on board. I don't want you to endanger yourself. Nobody's safe until this is over. Wait! You could die. At least tell me your name. It's not who I am underneath. But what I do that defines me. Bruce? Alfred, patch into the monorail control station. To contact Miss Rachel. Right. I need to know when she stops the train. Of course, sir. But be warned, your father built those trains to be driven, not remotely controlled. She'll only be able to stop it for a few moments at most. in position.
could disarm the explosives on the carriage doors. You can't stop Al Rule. It's too late. Then there's no reason for you to suffer to protect him. Suffer what? You don't want to find out. How do I disarm the charges? One, nine, four, two. That's the code. only moments away. Once we reach the center of Gotham, once we reach the Water Authority, there is no more Gotham. took my advice about theatricality a bit literally, don't you think? We both wear masks. But yours is a lie. You hate this city as much as I do, but you're afraid to do what's necessary. 
It's why you cannot fight injustice. And why you cannot stop this train. Who said anything about stopping it? Then you will die with the rest of them. There's only one man I'll let you kill. Murder. What do you call this? Justice. Alfred! Detonate the battle. Are you quite certain, huh? It's our only choice. Blow it. <laughs> 